Okay. Uh, give me a second. Right. Okay. Uh, give me a second. I need to check a couple things. Actually, first thing I should check is volume. Okay. Yep. As usual. Give me a second. As usual, I can be barely heard. Now check number two. Because the image I'm getting, I'm seeing, is not something I want to see. At all. So, uh, give me a second. Your channel. It's not something I want. Okay. Want to see. At all, give me a second. Uh, so, uh, give me a second. Okay, I can remove that. Easily, easily. Bada bang. Bada bang. Bada. Uh, I'm gonna. For some weird reason the uh screen seems to be a bit different for the channel for like the video itself uh let me just uh, for some weird reason the uh Green seems to be a bit Is there different a in this? for the Hi. channel for like the video itself. Uh, uh, let me just uh, uh, sorry for it repeating. It's uh, my thing repeating at green seems to be a bit. Uh, yeah, it looks like there's a bit of problematics. Uh, give me a bit. Uh, Right, uh, okay, no, that, no, 
Uh, okay, okay. Mm. Uh. I'll deal with this later. Currently, we're uh, kind of stuck with the uh, screen as it is. Which is annoying, but I'm just going to have to deal with it. So, uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, hmm. So, right. Another thing I've learned is that, uh, from past experiences, that if I say play certain games, like for example, uh, any game at all, I kind of have to like shrink all the tabs. If you're ever wondering, like, what happened to uh, that stream I was doing. Of like, you know, the stream I did of uh, Smack. liquidators. What you hatched? I'm gonna crush you like I crushed those eggs. I should probably explain what's going on. Uh, well, it says right here. Pathetic. So this guy, yeah, uh, basically, I. Removes your uh, siblings from existence. From I'm just gonna turn these all off. And then proceeds to run off like it was nothing. So, uh, yeah. You. Start off with just one ability. Punch. You have to... And, as you play the game, you have to fight people to learn how to win. So, anyway... Right. So, anyway, I, so anyway, on to the main topic of the stream, which hopefully you can hear me, and 
I suggest if you're listening and you don't want your parents to hear anything inappropriate, I suggest you put on headphones. So, basically, uh, it's hard to explain. But there's a small little fact. Uh, well, let's. Okay, so I'm not in any way, shape, or form going to explain how I found this on my homepage, but at one point, on my homepage, I found, uh, heh. I found this little comic of Gravity Falls. So, this comic was, I, less than wholesome. So, it's, uh, basically, uh, okay, so, I'm not gonna explain why it was on my dashboard, So, uh, uh, so the comic starts. With, uh, you know, the last with braces, Mabel, uh, Mabel's friend. So the comic starts with Pacifica. Having the last give a love letter for her to Dipper. <laughs> so Simple was simple. So, sorry, that has nothing to do with anything. So, then, 
one of Wendy Wendy's friends is comes up and is like pretend I gave you a concert ticket or something I don't remember and the ticket says uh I think it's been long enough uh uh for YouTube not to get mad at me it says fuck buddy pass one use or something like that so then she goes back to Wendy and they walk off and Wendy's like what'd you give him and she says concert tickets so what I'm saying is <coughs> Like, at one point, so, I saw that and was like, what would happen if, like, a year after, like, the entire, like, last, in the entire season, a year after, like, during summer vacation the next year, like, what if, like, uh, yeah. okay, oh, frick. Sorry, I didn't notice my computer wasn't plugged in. Uh, enter. By the way, I've played this before, but I haven't finished it. I only got, like, to the second area. Played only a little bit of it. But besides that, nothing really happened. Anyway, so, like, I then thought, what if somehow, like, when Dipper came back, since, you know, like, yada yada. Don't worry, this, if you want to know what they're saying, you can... Download the game yourself. It's like free. <sighs> okay. Right, so, I was like, what if, just like, for some unknown reason, Frick. Oh. Huh. 
can see it. Oh, uh, yeah. So then I thought, what would happen if, like, this was a part of a comic about Dipper on accidentally, like, accidentally creating a harem? Like, what if that, like, happened? Oh, frick. Uh... uh, so I think I know what I have to do. <coughs> yeah. Excuse me, what? What? What was that? <coughs> Wait. Oh, ho, ho. Thorn. Does thorns act as an attack? Oh, righty then. So, So, the small, minuscule thing, I just realized, yeah, yeah, let's back away, Perfect. Excuse me. Kinda not, haven't had any legitimate food for a while. I think the last time I had food was uh, the, the chocolate I had earlier today, which isn't really food per se. Anyway, <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Uh, hmm. okay. <laughs>
Anyway. <clears throat> uh, so. All right, so. I just thought, what if, like, what if, and this is a huge, what if, <laughs> like, okay, okay. Okay, so, huh. <clears throat> so, like, just think about it. Like, uh, I don't know. So, let me just check with you. <laughs> so I thought, how would that, like, how would it start? <clears throat> okay, I uh, can see. So, I just thought, how would that, like, work? <laughs> and, like, more importantly, how would it start? Uh... Uh, so, the small, minuscule, uh, like, uh, how would it start, exactly? <laughs> I'm like, what exactly would happen?
Let's see. <clears throat> so, how would it, like, start, exactly? So, uh, hmm. <clears throat> what, what's the difference between them besides the amount of times you keep them? You know, never mind. Right. So, like, think about it. Boom. Cool. <laughs> so, let's just put it all out. So, curse and, uh, Bounds would work well together. <coughs> because bounce seems to be every effect on the board, which is not what it meant. Like, I had curses on him, and he, he had muddle on me, and the kind of is six health instead of four. Which was his muddle on me, and that, and a bounce. So, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, let's go with the side effect. Build. Yeah. So, you. <laughs> so, uh, let's see. <coughs> Whoops, that's not what I meant to do. Let's just restart the uh, challenge. 
So, <clears throat> like, I just thought how it would start. So, like, you know how in certain areas in America, like, or if not everywhere in America, um, like, Valentine's Day is just like, oh, yeah, for people in school, it's just like, yeah, just give each other letters and stuff, yada, yada, blah, blah. So, <coughs> so, like, yeah, so, I just thought, like, due to two students doing something incredibly stupid in the bathroom, <clears throat> ending with, well, let's just say something very wrong. Let's just say, don't put the arsonist and the person, like, the person who believes in a cults, don't put them together. All I'm saying. <laughs> oh, I just realized it can go into there. <laughs> anyway, so, I just thought, like, a couple, like, a week or two before, like, <laughs> uh, by the way, the uh, comic I read, it was, like, what was it again? It was, uh, Valentine's Day, when the comic was taking place, or so I can tell. <sighs> Let's see what you hit me with. Uh, okay. <laughs> all right, all right. Royce. Oh, you're back. <sighs> so, I was just thinking, like...
Right. Uh... Oh, I didn't notice that was there. Hmm. Talk. <clears throat> so I just thought, what would happen? And how would it work? <clears throat> okay. Hmm. Flurry. <clears throat> and the uh... Hmm. Let me think about it. Oh, right. So, I was thinking, how would it work? Like, who would be first? Who would be the last? So, by the way, if anyone actually makes this, or it's already made, well, let's just say, I'm not going to complain to someone posting the link in the comments. <laughs> I'm not going to delete it either. So, anyway. Uh, like, I was thinking, how would it work? So, I was like, alright. So, then my mind went racing. So, I was like, alright. So, here's how it starts. So, it's Valentine's Day. And <laughs> at the Northwest House... The family's over, family and friends are over, as in Northwest only friends and family. And, uh, let's see. <clears throat> yeah, let's do that for now and. Anyway, so, mm, that's going to be a lot. <clears throat> right. Uh <sighs> mm. <coughs> hmm. Okay, so <clears throat> right, so let's try it again. So I just thought about it. Right, so at the Northwest family house. Uh, 
starting, they planned from morning to night to celebrate Valentine's Day in whatever way they felt fitting. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> Let's see. Right. So So <laughs> someone for some reason, spikes the punch. Okay, so what moves do I have? Uh, let's just put a punch there. <laughs> of course, little sip of thorns. Three punch, chip away, flurry. There we go. Mm. <coughs> For each effect. Hmm. Is there anything? No, I don't have anything. Hmm. Okay. <coughs> so, uh, hmm. Alright, have I first let me just double check. Flurry curse little sip get punch thorns. <laughs> right. Challenge. <coughs> oh, okay. I concede. By the way, the the ghost doesn't have any like interesting abilities, as in <coughs> the ability they do have is. Not one to be like useful. Basically, I'll show you. <sighs> First, let me check my card. Yep. So, 
right. Uh, curse. Look, this ability. Oh, if you lost a fight with this opponent. <clears throat> so, Pacifica drinks the, uh, wait, did I mention? Oh, right. One of the relatives, because these are the Northwest, spikes the punch with, well, let's just say this is Gravity Falls. <laughs> One day, a homeless man could walk up to you and be like, Oh, hey. Uh, hey, you. Uh, you want this drink? It's the strongest It's supposedly the strongest drink in existence. Are you... Do you want it? I'll give you it for like 15 bucks. And it's this bottle. This inconspicuous bottle. But, like... And this rich dude is like... You know what? Sure, I'll take it. <laughs> so, they take the bottle, without a care, when in actuality, the homeless person has, like, a six-pack of the stuff, and it was from this, like, dimension where alcoholism is, like, not a problem, it's a normalcy. <laughs> AKA normal or whatever the term is. <laughs> All right. Anyway, uh, so, So, let me think. Uh, oh. okay. So, Pacifica gets a cup of punch, and may I remind you, this is, uh, remember that little thing I was talking about, about this random homeless man? Could give pass you this bottle of what he says is the strongest stuff in existence <laughs> for fifteen bucks. Well, when the Northwest decided to spike the punch with one of those bottles, so everyone's flat out drunk. Pacifica gets some punch. <coughs> Mm. 
<coughs> and decides screw it that like and she had half like she took a sip and was instantly drunk so <coughs> Meanwhile, at the Mystery Shack, <coughs> Mabel found more fireworks. May I remind you this after the entire thing? The Stan brothers, the brothers have helped each other figure things out. And Stan Lee has regained most, if not almost all of his memories. <laughs> so. <laughs> so I just realized bounce perfect now let's try this again <laughs> so, Dipper is being told to keep watch for the police, so they don't get, so in case the police come back, like, uh, uh, the first time in the series, <laughs> the first time that we saw in the series where the police came and split up their little thing. <laughs> okay. Fireball. <laughs> okay. Little sip. Curse. And Thor, yes. If you'll excuse me. So, <coughs> there's the small little problem. Like, so. Dipper's keeping a lookout when <coughs> when suddenly <coughs> oh frick I just realized yeah yeah Thorns. <coughs> it 
So <clears throat> so basically <laughs> what happens next is well <laughs> it's kind of simple uh dipper's keeping a lookout when pacifica comes walking towards the house <laughs> He tells the others he has to go check on something and walks downstairs. Pacifica with basically what was now an empty bottle, uh, an empty plastic cup <laughs> of the spiked punch. Cool. Yeah. <coughs> hey. So anyway, where was I? <coughs> oh, I should probably check the cafe. So, Dipper opens the door, and it's like, hey. And, <laughs> so uh, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> so <clears throat> okay, okay. All right. So, next thing you know, so one second,
right uh mm. right i'm gonna go back upstairs and check there <laughs> So, Pacifica is flat out drunk. And it's like, hey, Dipper. Next thing you know, <laughs> next thing you know, they've done it everywhere but the kitchen sink. Mm. Snowfall, little sip. <coughs> Start with a fireball. think uh, anyway so <coughs> anyway so next thing you know they've done it everywhere including the kitchen sink I just realized. Uh, <coughs> leave. Let's just so. So, fireball's cool. Snow falls in SSD. Horns and curves come out here. Chip away. And your opponent loses half their current health. <coughs> <laughs> that would be fun. If it weren't for the fact that immediately kill me but yes let's start with this <laughs> so after so dipper then wakes up with Pacifica gone and but her cup's still there. He sniffs the cup and realizes that was alcohol she had in her system. By the way, uh I don't know exactly when the twins' birthday is, but I'm going off the assumption Happened between Valentine and summer vacation. I don't know. <laughs> so he's like, "Okay, that just happened." So he then he then realizes what happened. Goes upstairs and tells 
Stanley and Mabel, like, oh, yeah, that noise was like a rat. I was trying to get it out. Yeah, it was nothing. <laughs> so... <laughs> okay, so uh, let's back out. <laughs> Challenge. So anyway, snowfall first. So anyway, uh, <laughs> so then, <laughs> for like excuse me for so then Dipper goes outside slightly confused as to what the heck just happened By the way, this fight might take a while. So, Dipper goes outside, confused, and goes for a walk. While wandering through the woods, he wanders upon Wendy, who somehow, despite her looks, her father kept scaring away any love interest she had. So, <laughs> so, So, <coughs> so due to the, so then what happens next is, uh, interesting to say the least. <coughs> Wendy sees Dipper. Dipper sees Wendy. And before Dipper can run in embarrassment, well, let me give you a comparison to what happened. Say the goddess of rednecks. <laughs> has gone for years, gone on since uh, a couple thousand years without getting any D. So one day, she's trying to relieve her uh, stress <coughs> when a mortal walks by. So the mortal, so she then proceeds to, uh, this redneck, goddess of rednecks, proceeds to ride him like 
<laughs> proceeds to ride in this guy who by the way is this guy she noticed who is this average worker drone <laughs> office worker drone and proceeds to give this guy who by the way is virgin the time of his life Oh, frick. Uh, yeah. So, it was like a couple hours <coughs> after, uh, oh, frick, did it the wrong way. Uh, <coughs> after everything finally settled down. <coughs> <clears throat> so I just realized I could have gotten some better attacks, but I'm already this far, so I'm going to finish this fight. <coughs> anyway, so... Then, a couple hours pass, and Dipper wakes up under Wendy. So, he's like, alright, that just happened. So, he tries, so he tries and succeeds to squirm out from under her. <coughs> and grabs his clothes. And books it. <coughs> All right. Oh, <laughs> that plus that. <coughs> and uh, snowfall, move punch, and uh, hmm. Lifesteal, just for case. Oh, I already have Snowfall. Never mind. Uh, where is it again? Uh, find Bobby. Yes. <coughs> Alright, so I got all these folks. Yeah. I should probably get the cafe. 
<coughs> so, anyway. Right. <laughs> anyway, so, uh, let's see. <coughs> so, uh, then Dipper's like, oh, frick, because he agreed with his sister to, uh, I don't know. So him and his sister agreed with Stan to try and swindle as many people out of whatever they could at the Valentine's Festival. So he goes back home, washes up, and prepares for the festival. <laughs> and that's where the comic comes in. The letter is from Pacifica basically stating, don't, basically saying, don't tell anyone, or so help me, I'll make sure you never live, you never spend another second of your life again in your mortal coil or whatever. Anyway, so, <coughs> uh, to, to, yay. <coughs> right. So, yes. <coughs> uh, so anyway. Um, let's see. Oh. So, yeah, uh, I don't know what happens next, but slowly, like, you know, both the teenagers and, like, younger kids in the series, all of them are, like, Mabel and her friends and everyone around there. <laughs> is like 13, I'm pretty sure. So, what with that one where they break into a uh, convenience store and Dipper lies saying he's 14 so he can go with them saying that's basically teenage, teenager age. He's basically a teenager at that point, you know? <laughs> well, surprise, surprise, uh, they are now legitimately all 14. So they're all legitimately teenagers. <laughs> and so, slowly but surely, you know Wendy's friend group? All the girls in both Wendy's friend group, Mabel's friends, and Pacifica, all just slowly, one by one, are added to the harem until finally... 
like, summer vacation comes around, and a package is delivered at the door with, which is, which is, the package is for Dipper. So he opens the packages, and it's a bunch of uh, <laughs> pregnancy tests, all testing positive. There's a knock on the door, he opens it, and there is everyone who is in his technically accidental harem, just standing at the front door, pregnant. He passes out, and he snaps awake on the rooftop, <coughs> and then he snaps awake in a in his school chair and then Mabel snaps awake she's still in school and her brother and her and all the other students are still in class <laughs> The pyromaniac and a cult addict of the school did not do that thing, the ritualistic summon they did, and everything Mabel just dreamed up. Mabel stares at her brother, Dipper, And gives this smile. Like, you know that smile in some cartoons and movies and such? That smile that says, Oh, that basically, no matter whose side you're on, you look like you've just become the bad guy. Like, you've done something so evil. Like, that smirk and those eyes that look as much a smile as the smile you're giving. <laughs> like crescent moons for eyes. And a smile to match. That type of look. She looks at her brother. And does that smile. He looks over. Says what do you want? She says nothing. And then. The final shot is her going back to sleep. <laughs> and it fade as and as she leans slowly slumps back down over her desk <clears throat> as if the viewer themselves are falling asleep. Darkness begins to slowly fall down upon this, the page. Each panel slowly getting darker and darker with less light seen till finally your eyes are closed. Till finally they're closed. <laughs> You get a, the comic says, the end. And the credits roll. Or you can have a fake, the end. And, and you find Mabel passed out from the shock of her brother actually getting laid. As she's laying in her bed, and her brother's just like freaking out as he would, and stands, and Stanley is just 
laughing. Like, <laughs> like, wait. His grandnephew, I think it is, just got laid. And Stanford comes in, says to Dipper, slow down. You might die if you do it too many times. And walks out. Stanley just falls on the floor laughing because his brother was able to do the same thing for him when he was, like, during his time in school. Stanley, it's hinted at one point that Stanley had his own sort of harem in Stanford and I don't remember their names. Who goes who? Stanford's the smart one. Stanley is the uh, thief. <laughs> Stanford's the one who's scientifically in, who's into science, and Stan Lee is the one who <laughs> would probably rob a bank. You know. So Stan, so Stanley's rolling on the floor because it's hinted that this happened before. Stanley had gained a harem. And at one point, Stanford comes in like, hey, if you have too much sex, it'll be bad for your health. You ever wonder why, like, Stanley left home? Like, when he did, there was multiple reasons, and a lot of them were called child support. <laughs> so, Anyway, since I technically don't need to, like, really heal all, like, add so much health, what with Snowfall and four stacks of di Divine Body at this point, <coughs> I could just basically down them in, like, two wits. Yeah. Uh. Anyway, uh, what was that one I just got? Repaint. Deals damage. Opponent equal to the most recent damage they've taken. Okay. Why would I? Oh. Oh. <laughs> In case I'm using a hit, then wait move. Okay, that makes sense. In case I'm using a move that needs, like, heavy punch. Can't use consecutive, you know?
I don't really know why I'd have it. Oh, overpower. <coughs> if I, for some reason, used overpower, then I might want to, like, use repaint since, you know. But since I have this, which has 11 uses, excuse me, two things I use for immortality, and what literally gives me, like, 11 points of damage. Wait. 11 points. 11 points of damage. It only takes two goes to set up, but. So, what if I did Flurry Curse? If I use Curse five times, it might take a while to stack it, but I can do that. <coughs> then use Flurry, that'd be 15 damage. It takes six turns, but 15 damage. If I use that three times, that's 45 damage. Uh, but that would also mean, hmm, let me just look around. <laughs> There's thorns. Hmm. I could use thorns and. Fireball? Maybe? Hmm. <sighs> hmm. So, Thorns, these two will make me immortal. And no matter what I'm hit with, it will not kill me. I will not die. Thorns will mean whatever hits me gets hurt back. And if I take curse, it will strengthen, strengthen thorn. Let's see. Hmm. There's also resilience. Actually, let's get rid of snowfall. I know it's stupid. Life steal. I know, I know it's insane. It's insane. Curse, life steal. <coughs> Where is it? Uh, no. Mm. Interpretation. Curse, life steal, divine body, interpretation. Now repeat. If by any chance, within, I don't know, the next, I don't know, however, I come back to this playlist or. <coughs> any future playlist and say there's the comic I mentioned or another version of it that already exists or the version that someone made based off of what I said <coughs> well I'm not complaining and all I'm saying is I wouldn't have the comment deleted. That's all I'm saying. It's a curse. I steal an interpretation. 
So, let's see. One, two, three, four. So that's seven plus five, that's 12. This has four to this, so that's seven, 12. <coughs> so I can steal 12 health. Right, just let's get this over with. Find Bobby. Wait, recharge. That plus curse and interpretation. That would be insane. I hope you don't mind. Fine, fine. Interpretation. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm just gonna do a good old fashioned of this. Thank you. Reach out. Right, so. <coughs> That's that punch. Yeah. So, curse, interpretation, recharge. So, let's take our interpretation. <coughs> let's take our punch. Uh, let's put in snowfall. Let's put in, where's it? Divine body. <coughs> so, with snowfall and divine body, I'd live a long time. Curse. Oh, okay. Uh. <coughs> hmm. Okay, okay. No. Yeah, screw recharge. Matting thorns. Yeah, curse thorns when fall divine body. doesn't actually really matter what you hit me with. <coughs> I'm gonna use these all by the time this is over. <clears throat> I 
act, man. Boom. Chanting cool. Uh, nothing that really it interests me there. <coughs> so, right. Uh, did I? Hmm. I think I got everything in there. Just, hmm. That's the only thing I have. <coughs> so, I'm basically going to just wait for my for my enemies to just kill themselves. Well, that's it. <coughs> Uh, uh oh, as strong. Uh, hmm. <coughs> uh, hmm. Okay, so <coughs> yeah, seventy eight attack. Hmm. <clears throat> oh, right. Where is that? Ah, oh, here it is. There we go. All right. Let's try this again. Anyway, uh, sorry if you couldn't hear me. Uh, anyway, that's all I wanted to say. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, um, hmm, Tarpatoish, oh, how about you don't, I'll just use it now. Now currently, it's a clock. It's a race against time, which I won. Yeah. Boom. <coughs> Huh, bringing Terminate to a fight with Disable Achievements for that fight. Huh. Okay, that that's messed up. <laughs> oh, God. Snowfall, uh, Divine Body. Okay, let's get rid of that. As... Thorns and the <coughs> recharge. 
just for kicks and giggles. Yeah. All right. Whoops. <coughs> Sweet. What's that fourteen? Is that like? Uh, I'm guessing that's whatever is like. Sorry, my cards getting tangled up. I'm guessing that's something along the lines so of <coughs> whatever the highest amount of damage I've given to someone in the game. That's how much this take this does. I don't know. That'd be cool. Give me a second. There we go. Storms. <coughs> anyway. Oh, yeah. Well, what am I talking? One thing. I don't know. No. <clears throat> you know what? F you. I'm fighting you anyway. <clears throat> Punch. That's two damage. <laughs> Snowfall. I'm literally going to hit you. With a lot. You are going to regress. Doing what you did. <coughs> and no. I'm not going to be the better person. I'm guessing there is an ending. Where you walk away. And that's the better person. <coughs> but I'm not playing this. A freaking second time. I should probably check. The recording system. Because. Uh. I don't want to even repeat everything I've had to say. <sighs> no fault time by recharge. <laughs> Lol. I'm going to refill. <coughs> I'm going to use so many divine bodies you're going to regret existing. I think I might reach the triple digits. Maybe. I don't know. No, I don't think I thought. Maybe. I think. Yeah, I think I do. Yeah, I do. <coughs> I just realized. I have to take in and attack something that does damage. Right. You know what? Snowfall is all I need. I don't need all these extra BSs. <coughs> Interpretation. There's opponents. Damage. Huh, lol. That'd be... No. <coughs> Huh. 
<clears throat> Let's just take hmm. Ah, uh, yes, I will swear at you before killing you. Do I have to, like, what do I have to do? Fight them. <coughs> Yay. First, I'll curse the obese cabbage. <coughs> He literally has one attack that does two damage. And he only has five uses for it. Is this really it? Like, am I having my leg pulled or something? <laughs> uh. Now. Now that everything else has been used, how much damage does this do? 18! I think 18. Jeez. That's... Huh? No, I'm not gonna ask questions. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, yeah. 